What up, though? It's Calico, Landslide, fucking with Dedication TV. Subscribe to the network, man. Keep on pumping that good shit out. Keep on putting that good energy out in the world. Dedication TV, we dedicated, baby. Yeah, yeah, what up, what up? What's going on, man? Salute to everybody that's tuning into the channel. with your boy, Acito. I want to talk about Rome, man. Shout out to Emerson Kennedy, man. Ah, uh, man, this was a great event, bro. Great event. From what I saw, it was a great event. I did not get a chance to watch the live feed. I had to watch the playback. Um, but from the battles that I saw, man, I mean, I was satisfied for 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 what you charged. I mean, you, you nobody nobody like didn't show up per se. You know, there was a couple of slick ups, hiccups, part of me in the battle per se. But for the most part, you know, all the battlers showed up. And, you know, and they did what they were supposed to do, man. So. I want to get into it, man. So uh, let's talk about J Mills versus Real Name Brandon. Now, I only get only got a chance to see the first round. You know what I'm saying? So I can't really give a distinctive winner in this battle per se. Um, I will say, after watching the first round, I was edging it more so to Real Name Brandon. Um, you know, it's hard for me to really judge J Mills per se because I would like to see the second and third before I really give an opinion. Um, but from that first round, it's like, I, I didn't see much of an improvement from him. Um, but who knows? He could have turned up in the second and third. So I want to give him at least that benefit of the doubt, but I do like the scheme that a real name Brandon had in that first. I thought that was really fire. Um, but other than that, you know, shout out to them dudes, you know what I mean? Opening up the car, definitely a good look for real name Brandon to get somebody like a J Mills on his resume, even though since J Mills has been back, he really hasn't had any dominant performances to the point where it's like, yo, he won that clear. A lot of them been losses. You know what I'm saying? A lot of them been losses. But uh, shout out to them niggas, man. I'm going to definitely spend the block on that particular battle there. Let's get into Ace Ami versus Marv 1, bro. Oh, my God. My nigga Ace I mean, bro. Ace, bro, Ace. This is like a revolving thing we keep going over and over and over and over again. My G, you have to slow down your delivery. It's it's really hindering your process and your performance and you getting to the next level. This is gonna be your downfall, my nigga. Like you not be able, not being able to get through your material clean. You can have some of the fires bars. The fire setups. But, bro, if you can't get through the round clean without hiccups, without having to start again, without having to pause and get drinks of water in between the rounds of material, like, my nigga, you're just, you're going to be stagnant in that mid-tier range. You just had a phenomenal performance against Rum Nitty. Yeah, you had slight, slight little, like, hiccups, but it was nothing crazy to the point where I feel like it affected your round. This... Man, you would, you would, you would slip, you like, bro, you were sloppy all three rounds, bro. Like all three, like it just, it was, it was cringy, bro. It was not good to watch, bro. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Marv One. Marv One maybe had like one or two maybe little hiccups, but second and third was just clear, like clear talking that shit. You know what I'm saying? And it could have been a very competitive battle had Ace really got his material clean, but it's like you can't give him no rounds. That's just my personal opinion. I can't give you no rounds. None at all. So I had Marv 1 with the 30. Uh, shout out to Marv 1, man, for the Hartford Whalers hat. I definitely see you, my nigga. Shout out to you for that. Definitely you def definitely get some points for that shit, bro. <laughs> no, sir. But uh, shout out to Ace I Amin, mean, man. <sighs> Ace, man, you got to do something, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? I don't know your management, your people on your team, if they're not recommending that you change things up, but you need to do that, bro. Cause this is this was a big opportunity. This was a YouTube drop. You're fresh off the Rum Nitty battle. A lot of people didn't really see the Rum Nitty battle, but they're hearing about you having such a great performance. For you to get in the battle and not get through your material all three rounds is very disheartening, bro. It's really disheartening. I hope you get back to the drawing board and make those proper adjustments, man. Because you got a lot of talent. You have all the other intangibles to be a superstar. My nigga, you just, you, you have to tighten that up. You have to. Shout out to Ace I mean. <clears throat> Let's see. Who else we got? Um, oh, B-Magic. B-Magic and Sheet Happens. 
very, very bad, very great battle that I was looking forward to seeing. That was actually the first battle I watched on the playback. Um, <clears throat> this is another situation where not getting through the material clean can really hinder your victory. Um, I felt, I felt B Magic had some shit in this battle. Like, he had some crazy-ass bars, bro. The Louis Vuitton 40 was... He said, Louis Vuitton 40, he was dying by design. I chased a nigga off stage like you not the father. Like, ah, oh, Bars like that, crazy. But then he'll have moments where it's like, I said, I said, damn. I said, like, yo, y'all gotta stop doing that. Stop saying damn, bro. Do something else. Like, come on with a different word, bro. Like, you're making it too obvious that you fucked up. You had to slip up. Like, come on, man. Be magic, man. And I felt like, too, it be magic. Like, his first round was so crazy. Second round was like this. Third round was like flat. Like, he wrote totally down in his battle. She wrote up every single round. You know, she's first round, I was like a like, little dizzy, per se, because I wasn't catching a lot of the material. He had a really rapidly fast delivery. But once he got to the second and third, he kind of like shift gears and slowed it down a little bit. And I was able to catch a lot of the bars. Um, and he was talking his shit, bro. Shout out to She. I had She all three rounds. You know what I'm saying? All three. You know what I mean, first could be debated, but for me, I gave it to She. Um, you know, be magic, man. You know what I'm saying? You just had the fire battle with Arsenal. You know what I mean? For you to get somebody on URL like a She happens, I would think you would kind of turn up, but. <sighs> I don't know, man. That's two thirties, bro. Mob one, and she happens. Um, let's let's get to Jazz the rapper versus New Jersey Twerk, man. This battle was fucking fire, bro. This battle was fire. <laughs> Round of applause, man, to New Jersey Twerk, Jazz the rapper. This is definitely gonna be in the top ten, if not top five, battles for twenty twenty three, man. I'm telling you, the back and forth in this battle was fucking crazy. I gotta watch this like more than one time i only watched it one time bro on the first watch i had jazz taking the third i kind of edging the third pretty convincingly for me i i had new jersey twerk taking the second pretty clear convincingly to me it really came down to the first round on the first watch and i'm like in a tug of war you know what i'm saying like i'm leaning more towards new jersey twerk i got twerk in the first and the second round but i do feel like jazz was wilding in that first so I definitely have to go back. Like, for me, there's no loser in this battle. Like, they both won. They both put on incredible performances. They both lived up to... The battle lived up to the hype. Um, we got what we asked for. We got our money's worth. You know, even from the visual aspect. Like, it was fire, bro. It was fire. You know? And I feel like this is definitely going to help Jazz's resume. And it's definitely going to help New Jersey Turks' resume for, for Champion and for Wody. You know what I'm saying? Like, so... It's 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 definitely a fire battle, man. Y'all have to see this battle. Like it's definitely, um, I think it's definitely a half a mil million dollar view battle. Less than thirty days, absolutely. Like this shit has bars, delivery, you know, the comedic side, like everything, different flows, different cadences, like everything. They checked every single box off with this battle, bro. Shout out to Jazz. Shout out to New Jersey Twerk, man. This is a great look going into whatever battle they have next. This is great energy, bro. This is great energy. You know what I mean? So, but uh, shout out to Emerson Kennedy, you know, the whole Bay at the Sea network. I thought, you know what I mean? Like, I'm, I'm curious to see how this is going to look back on the on the playback. I've been drinking a little bit, excuse me. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm, I'm really curious to see because during like, I guess the live taping, you can see certain wires and stuff. So I, I'm pretty sure they're probably going to, shrink the footage a little bit and make it, you know, a lot cleaner, put some graphics and stuff on it. So I think when we get the actual total package, I think this shit going to look incredible. I think it's going to look incredible. But um, shout out to Emerson Kennedy. <clears throat> if I had to grade this car, um, one out of 10, I'm, I'm going to give it like a 7.5, bro. 7.5. I think, it, I think you know, for the, for the small amount of battles that it had, you know, like I said, the battles, actually, I'm going to give it an eight because... The battles weren't long. You know, the battles were like 25 minutes. You know what I mean? 90-second minute rounds, perfect. Not three, four, five-minute rounds. We got to sit through a whole fucking first, second, and third. Got to do 
recap the bars. Like, it's too much. Like, this, I can digest it easily. That's why after this, I'm going back and I'm watching New Jersey Twerk versus Jazz again. And I might do another prediction on a second watch. Because this battle was so close. So close, bro. It's so close. But... You know, shout out to Emerson Kennedy. I'm looking forward to seeing what you continuously do in the culture. I like what you're doing, you know, with these events. I like the coordination. I like the concept behind the whole entire scenery of these battles, man. So shout out to you for doing your thing, man. Make sure you guys check out these battles when they drop on YouTube. I don't know if they will be hitting the URL TV app. I will not be surprised if they do first. But either way, you know what I mean? You definitely want to subscribe to their YouTube and Get the app, bro. Get the URL TV app. But um, let me know what you guys think in the comment section, man. Let me know who you guys have winning New Jersey Twerk versus Jazz. What rounds? Talk to me. Let me know. Um, Subscribe to the channel. Follow me on all social media platforms. You know what I'm saying? Support your boy, man. I'm working, baby. I'm working, man. I'm working, man. It's your boy, Acito. I'm out. Peace. Oh, baby. Big shout to Dedication TV. They're on the line, man.